Hi guys, guess who's here? <gasps> Mr. Simon Parker Nagel. What's up guys? Best brother in the world finally came and visited me after 11 years. Yes. Yeah, 11 years since I've been in Vancouver. It's changed a lot. Yeah, I usually go down and visit him. So this is his first time finally making it back to Canada. And I'm gonna take him to a lot of my favorite spots like Shizania and um, She's in your East is East, bubble tea. Right? How special. Yeah. I feel like you're... Bambi, do you Michael. think we should film a vlog? Yeah. Do you think we should go get a bubble tea? Yeah. It's like a healthy bubble tea. Yeah. Oh, of course. Yeah. <laughs> None of that powdered stuff. No. No. Bambi, do you think that we should go get powdered bubble tea? No. I think we should get a healthy bubble tea? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, and I tell him what we're gonna do. <laughs> um, film a vlog? Yeah, but. <laughs> so today we are going to go down to Gastown and surprise one of my super close friends. Um, he owns this uh, walking tour company. So basically they give like uh, walking tours to people around uh, Vancouver tell them like about some uh, interesting historic facts and show them like hot spots that they can go you know because most people are here on vacation to take the tour so we're gonna go and surprise him and his brother and uh yeah let's go you guys like i want this vlog to be interesting for you guys but i feel like i'm not the best vlogger like i'm always wondering like oh what do i film and then we do stuff and then i forget to film it so we're gonna try our best i'm gonna try my best to be a good vlogger today because i really want to do a vlog with this guy mr right. simon parker nago oh, he, cool, he's ready to go okay okay we'll see we're gonna surprise one of simon's best friends here down in gastown because he has a walking tour two need tours they do walking tours in vancouver so we're gonna surprise him because he doesn't know that simon is in town oh i think he's did he spot us that looks like Josh. No, it's really close. Should I put my computer up? Yeah. Uh oh, is it Instagram? Oh, it Go is on. Josh! I said that was Josh. <laughs> so, so Nate, Nate must be uh, close by. Oh, maybe because he's in there and he saw you. Oh, yeah. What was it? Welcome to the Tuni Tour. So we are at Shizenya right now, and this is uh, this braised lotus root, and it is amazing. I'm addicted to this stuff now. <laughs> yeah. So we just got our meals. I am having the Mighty Astro Boy Dawn. This is one of my favorite things from Shizenya, and this is actually um, ground up lotus root. It tastes so good. It has like a little bit of sweetness. We have the avocados. Um, a nice bed of salad and then some quinoa and brown rice underneath. I'm addicted to this stuff. And then I have my 
lotus root appetizer. This is braised lotus root. It's kind of crispy and it's in kind of a sesame sauce. We have all our teas. And then what do you have, Sai? Um, so I have the new organic and maicha tea. We got some gluten-free soy sauce and uh, two of my favorite rolls here. Delicious. <laughs> Hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> um, so we just finished off having lunch at Shizenya. It was amazing like always. That's like, that's definitely one of my favorite restaurants. I got Simon here. addicted. Now he understands that I wasn't exaggerating how good that place is. Yeah, I, I love it there. It's amazing. But we just left the girls there. Mary, she's so sweet. Um, but now Simon's freaking out because we just noticed something across <gasps> the street. Honolulu, my favorite place. Honolulu coffee. So we're going to go check it out because Simon's all excited. We're going to feel like we're in Hawaii on this freezing cold <laughs> Vancouver day. So let's go check it out. You guys, look at that. Indian rose milk tea, a botanical blend of Indian rose petals, Egyptian chamomile paired with oat milk, house-made syrups, lemon juice, and garnished with a sprinkle of cinnamon Honolulu coffee. Man, do we have do we have room for something, Simon? But look, they have acai bowls. Well, I'm pretty full, but I'm definitely gonna get a coffee. Okay, let's go check it out. sister just asked if I wanted to uh, do like a facial thing and I was like yeah maybe and, th and then um, she was like she's like oh I have like all these blue beautify products I'm like okay yeah <laughs> awesome let's do it that... my brother is the biggest fan of blue beautify yeah well, well they're like the products just work so well with my with my skin like I've had skin problems before and um and like tried a bunch of different stuff and like until I found this stuff, like like literally every product that they have goes so good with my, oh, I guess I with my skin. Oh, so, yeah. so this is my favorite um, exfoliant. I mean, I I love the the pineapple one so much too, but this one I, I feel like it has more um, like exfoliant. Yeah, I like the pineapple one because I like more. Ooh, I like more enzyme exfoliants, but you like that because it's coconut, and I know you like that one because it smells like Hawaii. <laughs> Well, pineapple smells like Hawaii too, right? <laughs> but yeah, we thought it would be fun to do a facial for the vlog. Every time someone comes over to my apartment, which is never, I like to do a facial with them. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. So I think I'm going to do, like, are we going to do an exfoliant first? or We're going to do the oil cleansing method first. Oh, okay. Because I don't think you've done that before i don't think so and also do you guys notice something very similar about me and simon we didn't purposely do this <laughs> well we kind of did it. <laughs> but we are both the biggest office fans Ooh, why my voice so cold <laughs> all croaky like that we're both the biggest office fans um so we have our dunder mifflin t-shirts on yeah i brought mine down here and then i was wearing it today and my sister's like i have one too yeah. So I was thinking, I'll just hold this and try doing the facial with one hand. This is called the one hand facial challenge. <laughs> and I'll just hold this in the other hand and then you can just uh, do it all. So I'll okay. get you to spritz the stuff on Sure. My... All right. Okay. So first off, we're going to use the organic, organic calendula cleansing oil. Yes. Okay. So. Ready? Yeah. Put... Give me like, yeah, two, two or three. Okay. I'll do three. Oops. Yeah, and then you can put some on yours and right. just massage it in. Oh, I want to do the gua sha on you. So, should I still do this one? Yeah. Okay. So we just massage this into our face. And then we're going to take a warm washcloth and wipe it off. Okay. Okay. 
can you like even speed up for the job? Yeah. This girl like Talia, totally, she knows how to do anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, so now I'm gonna do some gua sha on Simon. I should actually get you to put a razor on that and then just give me a <laughs> unshaved in there. Okay, now we're gonna go here. You do either way, but. Ow! Oh, what? I'm just doing that. Oh. <laughs> I like cut your earring or something. It's hard. It's I have a difficulty doing it on someone else. Should I try it? Oh well, yeah, I, I guess I, you I think could. I kind of get the. Uh, yeah, so you can do your chin. Chin. So basically, you just thumb there, index there. You can do it kind of more flat too. Like this. Yeah. Okay. You're just contouring your jaw. Okay, now what comes next? And then um, you can do... Oh, cheek? Okay. Yeah, cheek. And then kind of like bring it Massage up Massage it? Okay. Yeah, kind of bring it flat. You can do it slowly. Okay. Something like that? Yeah. Just like um, bringing the circulation to your skin. Lifting your skin. Do you like it? Oh, yeah. Forehead. It's pretty cool. And then you can do the nose. You just made that move up. <laughs> <laughs> this is Simon's signature technique. And you can do this tongue scraper. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Okay, so now we can. All right, um... I'm feeling good now. <laughs> so next step is just sort of getting a warm, damp towel, and you just. Put it over your face. Sorry, this isn't very hot anymore. Cool down quite fast. And then what, you just wipe it off? Yep. Just kind of gently wipe the oil off. See, your skin feels nice and clean and soft. This is so fun doing a facial with you. Mm, okay, so now we can actually exfoliate, do another exfoliation. Like using the cloth exfoliates, but um, we can, you can do the coconut one and I'll do the pineapple one. Okay, cool. Okay. Um, let's do this. I'm using the coconut exfoliant. My sister's using the pineapple enzyme. I have it on my finger here already. I'm just gonna get a little bit of this out. All right, ready? Yeah. No, 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 no. Boys are so rough when they do their skin. <laughs> and then we'll just wash that off. Look, Simon's beating me in the long hair department. <laughs> so now we're just doing the charcoal face mask. And yeah, you know how to do face masks, you're an expert. Oops, I think I need some more. Right. People are gonna be like, oh my God, you're sticking your fingers straight in there. Well, we just cleaned our hands. We just did the oil cleansing method to our hands. <laughs> it's okay. You know, we should use the spatula, but. But we literally just washed our hands, so. Yeah. You know. And by the way, this video is not sponsored by Blue Beautify. I know it seems yeah. like we all we talk products. about is Blue Beautify and use their products, but that's just kind of what we use and we, we like just doing like what facials. We like. Yeah. The heart wants what the heart wants. Okay, cool. So look at this. I think I'm done. Thumbnail. Doo -doo -doo. So how long do we leave this on for again? Um, oh, seven to ten minutes. minutes, yeah. All right, well, I guess we'll be back in seven to ten minutes. Cool. Mm -hmm. You look cool. Oops. Okay, so we've left the masks on for ten minutes, so we're just going
gonna wash them off now. This mask is kind of messy, so don't get it on everything. So this is actually another thing I've uh, become obsessed with um, since being in Canada. I've been using, my sister has these uh, mint charcoal um, crush and brush. So it's really cool. Like instead of it being just like, you know, regular toothpaste, um, they're these little, let's see if you can see them there on the bottom. They're like these little um, tablets. Yeah. And uh, you just kind of like chew on them and they break up and start like foaming up and they're, there's some different flavors. There's like mint, charcoal, straight up mint. That's the Moringa. This is another one. It's a remineralizing. Yeah, I I tried this one and I actually really like it. That's not like a, a tablet. It's just no. a regular toothpaste. Pace, yeah. All right, so next we're going to be um, toning our face and we are going to use the organic witch hazel toner today. Let's see. Can you smell what else wow. that has in it? Um, yeah, it's like a really familiar smell. Lavender. Oh, really? Okay. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, I miss our time spring, the Evan Healy facial testers at Whole Foods. <laughs> well, you just gotta come back and visit soon. <laughs> Every time we go to Whole Foods, we spray the Evan Healy oh, look hydrosol it. testers on our skin. Oh yeah, Evan Healy, Evan Healy. right there. I love this stuff. The Wild Carrot Nourishing Eye Balm. Okay, so now we can finish off. Oh, try the Rose Hyaluronic Serum. Can you give me a squirt on my hand too? Thank you. Yeah. This one-handed facial is very difficult. Actually, it's not too difficult. I might do the Organic Chamomile Night Oil Serum as a moisturizer. Okay, so what I'm gonna do too. How many do you want? That's good. Yeah. <laughs> Just kind of patting it into my face. Well, that's our facial, guys. Let's zoom in at our faces. Do they look refreshed and dewy? I think so. Hey guys, so we are walking along the seawall right now in downtown Vancouver. For those yes. of you that don't know what the seawall is, it's a, it's like a little walkway kind of thing um, that surrounds, correct me if I'm wrong, sorry, surrounds all of downtown Vancouver. Yeah, you can get, you know, to Stanley Park, you can walk around Yale Town. I think it even goes to Science World and Granville Island. Um, but yeah, you can just spend your day walking along the sea. So we're right here um, by the water and you can see that there's a bunch of, you know, different boats here and stuff like that. And actually right there in the background is Granville Island. Bambi is like very nervous about having other people walk him. You can see he keeps looking back for me. But Uncle Simon is taking him for a little stroll around the seawall or the pee wall, as Bambi likes to call it, because he likes to pee on it. All right, one last stop at Shizenya before I leave. Are you excited we could come here one last time? Yes, I am. I'm just sitting here all crunched up drinking my celery juice but I thought I would end the vlog now because me and Simon of course forgot to end the vlog and now he's back home so I miss him but we had so much fun filming for you guys and we hope you enjoyed the video so yeah don't mind me I just got out of the shower so my hair's wet but yeah I guess I will see you in my next video. Bye.